How eating vegetables can improve your mood and the top 5 running habits that slow aging. Welcome to my channel Mani Films. Like and subscribe share how to make healthy food changes. Indeed, truly, expanding your admission of greens every day can really have an effect on your emotional well-being, and by eating only over two servings day to day you might see a massive change in your general bliss, more on that exploration in a moment. It's a well-known fact that the food you eat can play into your temperament and general solace in your body, and utilitarian medication master Amy Sapilla, PharmD, head of pharmacy at the Cook's Nursery in Huron, Ohio, took to the Mind Body Green webcast recently to make sense of why. What your eating routine can mean for your temperament. Paying attention to how your body feels subsequent to eating specific food varieties is fundamental to deciding the best dietary example for your physical and psychological wellness, yet here's a here's a clue, a foundation of this ought to be vegetables. Referring to a randomized controlled preliminary distributed in the Diary of the Foundation of Nourishment and Dietetics, Sapala portrayed 75 grown-ups in North Dakota who were weren't hitting their suggested veggie consumption. The mediation bunch ate over two servings of veggies, in addition to vegetables, avocados, and other supplement thick plants, each day. These individuals weren't eating 10 or 20 cups of vegetables daily. One fascinating place of note with regards to this study is that more than two cups is as yet not an outstandingly enormous measure of vegetables, particularly according to what driving medical services specialists suggest. Indeed, mixed greens and simmered vegetables are generally a choice while hoping to beef up your eating regimen, yet all at once are trick of the trade. Eating your vegetables truly can make you more joyful, and whether you're like them air broiled, bubbled, or as a useful nourishment greens powder, one way or the other your body will much obliged. The main 5 running propensities that sluggish aging running is an astounding activity to incorporate into your daily schedule. I am here today to share the best 5 running propensities that sluggish maturing, so tune in up and bind up those tennis shoes. Assuming you're hoping to dial back the maturing system and work on your general well-being, I suggest that you integrate running into your wellness schedule. The following are 5 running propensities that sluggish maturing to consider. You can make a vigorous space, improve your mitochondrial capability and resting pulse, and furthermore bring down your circulatory strain. Zone 2 preparation is between 60 to 70 percent of your maximum pulse, and remaining in that range the whole time during your runs is significant. Assuming that you're hoping to work on your well-being and dial back maturing, I suggest getting going with a few Zone 2 meetings each week for 30 to 45 minutes. Related, the best wellness propensities that sluggish maturing, Mentor uncovers. Stretch runs are an incredible method for consuming more fat and furthermore work on your anaerobic perseverance and mitochondrial capability. To perform stretches, get going at a lower force run, and afterwards substitute that with a quicker paced run. A decent stretch regardless comprises of a 60 second run, trailed by a 15 to 20 second quicker pace. Related, the best cardio activities to lose instinctive fat and slow maturing, coach says. 3. Run with directional changes if you need to dial back maturing and work on your coordination, knee, and foot well-being, it's smart to play out a couple of drills where you're taking a different path. It selects more muscles in your lower body and powers you to work harder because of the slope. You'll begin at the base, and run uphill as quick as possible until you arrive at the exceptionally top. Furthermore, assuming you're running routinely, it's essential to observe the number of miles that you're placing in and at what power every week.